is up YouTube man welcome back to my channel I appreciate all you guys for tuning in so in today's video you know it's it's about to be summer you know it's in it spring summer it's that type of vibe man so I was gonna hit y'all with two videos one with like the trends of spring and summer and one with like just low-key brand but I said why am I doing that I'll just give it to y'all all at once so today's video is go on for y'all a lot of great information it's a video on you know what trends for spring and summer and what to buy these trends. So this is more like a brands video. You know, my past video, I did a low key brands, um, top five low key brands. A lot of y'all wanted a, you know, a second part to that. So this is kind of what that is. This is low key, all low key brands and where to buy the upcoming trends for this spring, this upcoming summer, man. Cause I want y'all to be fly, man. Y'all know y'all can't be outside. Cause it's summer, vaccines out, y'all gonna be outside. So you gotta be fly when you outside. So I got y'all. Um, I know I haven't been that consistent lately, guys, but you know, I'm not gonna say I'm back. You just gonna see, you know, I can speak louder in words and all that, but we gonna get right into this video. And before we even start, I need you to go down and like this video for me. Um, subscribe if you ain't subscribed. If you are subscribed, you know, send this video out, you know, get my name out there. Cause it's summer now, it's time to take over. But like I said, I'm not gonna do too much talking. You just gonna see. Um, and make sure you hit that bell. If you didn't hit that bell, comment any videos you want to see, man. That's enough of me talking logistics. We're we going to get right into this video, man, because I know you want these brands. I'm, I'm done stolen. I'm going to give you what you want. But, yo, man, I got you right now. Let's get it. sponsored at all y'all this is really just genuine what i'm liking in the fashion community trying to help y'all with my genuine advice i'm um, even if it was sponsored i'm never gonna put something in that i don't like so this is just what i genuinely feel like any of these brands owners if you, any of y'all watching this video man hit me on the side we can we can build something because i really do love all these brands that i'm mentioning man for real um so let's get right into it all right so we'll start off with shorts now this spring this this summer um Mesh shorts are gonna take over the above the knee mesh shorts. Last summer, I felt like sweat shorts more had it, but this summer, definitely mesh shorts are the way to go. So, if you're looking for mesh shorts, you know the king of mesh shorts right now, Eric Emanuel. So, everyone's heard about him. You got these crazy shorts here. Um, honestly, they are hard to get, however, they may be selling out very, very quickly. The resale value really goes up to like $200. Um, every time you post a picture like this, they drop on Friday at noon. So if you're trying to get them, hop on at noon, try to get them for, I believe, retails around, around 100. And his brand's really taking off right now. They just took over the Babe store in Soho, if you didn't know that. They're just doing, they're doing crazy collabs. They, they did a collab with um, McDonald's All-American recently. They did a collab with Babe, actually, for Babesters, which is crazy. I know it's not shorts, but I just want to throw that out there. But that's crazy. So that brand's really taking off. They're going to be around a minute. So honestly, that's an investment piece. If you want to spend a um, hundred on them, they're definitely going to go up in value. Um, they are nice shorts too. If you just need a pair of basic shorts to um, walk around, they're tough. Um, but they are very pricey. So if you're looking for a cheaper alternative, Kinetic Society also has some nice shorts. They do sell out too, but and they are cheap. I'm not sure about their release information. I just got put onto them. So shout out to GT Vision for the put on. He's also another YouTuber. Um, other than that, I feel like just stick to basic shorts. You know, you got ASOS, you got Boohoo Man, you got Romwe. Just short, just mesh shorts are the way to go though. So these are just like five different companies you can go to. to cop some mesh shorts. Um, make sure just make sure they above the knee because that's really been taking over the past couple years and this. Um, I'm pretty sure that's gonna be around for a minute now. Um, but yeah, that's that's what we gotta say about shorts. Um, Eric Emanuel, Kinetic Society. And then you got the cheap ones, Boohoo Man, ASOS, Ron We. You also got Mitchell and Ness. How can I forget Mitchell and Ness? Mitchell and Ness is crazy because they, they got these like team shorts that you could just pair with a white tee, pair with a black tee. It's an easy fit, but it's very effective and you look just very smooth because your shorts is like the graphic tee. It's like switches. Just don't pair the graphic shorts with the graphic tee because then you're doing too much and then you're going to look stupid. So, you know, keep it basic on the top and keep it crazy on the bottom. And keep it crazy on the top and basic on the bottom. It's all about proportions, man. So now moving on to the tees. And you guys already know, graphic tees. It's summer. Graphic tees. So, Mike, where am I going to find some graphic tees? I got you, man. I'm going to put you on some brands with some crazy graphic tees that you really need to check out. Um, they are low-key for sure. Um, so here we go. All right, so first up, we got I'm DJ Flacco. 
Um, he he's like uh, just a fashion insp inspiration. He got crazy fit pics on his page, so check him out. But he has his own brand, and now in these, he does, he basically just does basic um, graphic tees, and these graphic tees are actually insane. Like I love all of them. They like fifty to sixty dollars, but they're so tough. Um, he's a highly loved. I don't know much about him. I just got put on him recently, but honestly, bro, if you need a graphic tee, this I've, I'm definitely gonna cop some off of him. Cause these graphic tees are insane. They're so smooth. They're so clean. I believe they're great quality too. That's why they're so they're so pricey. But as I said, I haven't gotten a pair, so I don't want to mislead y'all. But check them out for yourselves if you're looking for a graphic tee. If you pair one of these graphic tees with some basic Eric May shorts, you know what I'm saying, or some you know ASO shorts. Like I'm saying, I'm telling y'all, I got y'all. Um, other other graphic tees also are um, J Edits. Now he honestly. I believe he has the best graphic tees I've ever seen. They're all unique. Like he doesn't drop that often though. Um, he doesn't have like a store like where you can just come and get him. You gotta be on his page and waiting for him to drop. Um, Cause I believe it's just him. But his graphic tees, his Kid Cudi tees will put me on to him. His Kid Cudi too is ridiculous. I don't see anything like that. That this I'll pull up. This tee is insane. He just dropped a J Cole um, tee. At, when J. Cole's album drops, so he be doing stuff like that for the culture, and that's cool. I really mess with his brand. I really, I'm waiting to get my hands on a T because his T's is crazy for real. I'm about to pair that with some heat I just picked up, so be on the lookout for that. But he has both of these people got some crazy graphic T's for real. All right, next we'll go kicks, and I'll put you on with that too. So aside from the regular drops, you know, the regular Jordans that are dropping, um, and everything, you know, I like Jordan, I got a pair of fours, I got a pair of ones, this and that. But there's some other brands too that are coming out with in the kick game. I'm serious. Um, this brand right here, Cool Kai. Well, he has a, it's like a spin-off of Jordan Ones. My man's put me on to this. Shout out to him. But this brand is insane, man. Like, oh my god. If you aren't if you aren't tuning to him, bro, tune in right now. Cause his he gonna blow up and bro, I'm getting a pair of them for sure when I start buying kicks again. Cause Bro, look at just look at him. I'll put a couple pictures on the thing. I don't I don't know too much about him, but I know he works very, very hard because like every single day he's posting new stuff on the gram. Every single day I'm seeing a new model. Like, whoa, what the heck? Like you just dropped literally two days ago and you already putting new models up. It's crazy. But shout out to him. If I copy pair, I do a little review for y'all. But like I said, I'm not really buying kicks right now, focus on my closet, but when I do buy kicks, I'm definitely getting a pair of his no cap. Cause his are so tough. Um, now we'll go move on to accessories and you know summer. The summer truck trucker hats are gonna be huge. You know fitted hats. Fitted hats are gonna be huge, of course. Um, I, I mentioned that in my last um video. I did a summer um 2021 trends video. So, truck um fitted hats are gonna be huge, but trucker hats also, especially for the summer. You know, cause it just fits with the you know tee and shorts vibe. You know, cause they got holes in it. I feel like it just fits the aesthetic even more. So for trucker hats. I think who makes one of the best trucker hats, honestly, is San Juan. And they're honestly a brand that's going to blow up entirely, not just their trucker hats. I put them on my list for trucker hats, but they're going to blow up entirely because they just got some fly shit, to be honest with you. They got tees, they got sweaters, they got whole collections. Their whole collections is just so, so smooth, man. And their collections always stand for something. Like his last collection, or one of his last collections, it was um, cities that raised me. So he had, you know, he had New York was a city, LA was a city. So this is like something that means something to him. This is why like the brand stands for something. So I, I feel like that's tough. Every time a brand stands for something, it draws me to it. Because then it has me feel like the designer actually really, really cares about not only the brand, but the customers and the art that he's trying to portray to his um, audience. So that's crazy. So check out San Juan, man, for real. And now, um, I talked to you about... You know, I talked to you about shorts because I know that's going to be crazy this summer. I talked to you about your graphic tees because graphic tees are crazy every summer. That's, that's a trend, but, you know, that's going to be around for a minute. Um, But, you know, with Jay Edits and um, um, I'm, I'm DJ Flacco, they got some unique ones with the, the culture, and that's why I feel it's going to take off this year. Then you got Cool Kai with the Jordan 1s because, you know, spinoff Jordan 1s is a crazy trend as we've been seeing. As you know, the sneaker community is kind of falling off, which I don't really like the sneaker community right now. I could do a separate video on that if you guys are interested on why I don't really mess with the sneaker community right now. But, and then I talk to you about accessories. You know, you got trucker hats, you got um, sunglasses. Sunglasses, you can cop off of ASOS, to be honest with you. Um, they got a bunch of different ones. Trucker hats, ASOS, you know, just remember to accessorize. The colors to look out for, look out for earth tones, look out for neutrals, look out for all that. 
But one brand I want to put you on to that does all of the above aside from the kicks, Basket Case Gallery. Their brand is going to blow up for real. Um, they're one of my favorite brands right now. Honestly, I've I've seen collections and I've liked everything in the collection and their owners are so involved. I know they did a pop-up in New York. I didn't get to go when my friends went and I saw how involved, how like he talks to the owners and how involved he was. I'm pretty sure the owner like helped him out with a custom pair of jeans or something like that. So the owners are, are just nice and love their brand. Just want to get it out there. And that's, that's what I feel like, you know, if you love your brain, it's going to work. So they truly do love their brand. Their pieces are so good. Their pieces are timeless, bro. Like their cuts on their pieces is crazy. They got crazy silhouettes. They really on some fly for real. Like their silhouettes are so crazy that I, I could tell that they focus on like the art and the clothes. They focus on like how it's gonna look on the individual, not how they brand, like how they logo looks. And that's two things with fashion that two different brands are. Some brands look at how nice their logo is gonna look in this placement, and other brands look at how nice the entire piece is gonna look on this person. Like, like that's the case. I had a game. I'm telling you. That's Kiss Gallery is so smooth, man. They're one of my favorite brands, for real. So that's, like, it brings high fashion where they focus on the art of the clothes, as I mentioned in my last video, so check that out. To, to meet streetwear, uh, uh, it's accessibility and it's price range. So I like, it's so dope. Um, so check them out, for real. Tap into their um, IG, because they're going to blow up. Like, bro, put a pin in this. They will blow up. I promise you, Basket Case Gallery is really up next, because... And all the collections is so different. I don't I don't know how to classify them as a brand. So that's why they're really gonna blow up. Um, they're probably gonna be a top brand in the future. Like top, top. So that's some brands to check out. Uh, I mentioned the rundown of brands. I said I said Eric Emanuel, of course, Kinetic Kings, and then you got the typical ASOS, Boohoo Man, Ron We Ron We Break for Shorts, for real. You got Mitchell on that shorts, you got J Edits, you got I'm DJ Flacco, you got Cool Kai, you got um, San Juan, I mentioned, and you got Basket Case Gallery. So I just threw a whole bunch of brands that y'all really tap into all of them. They're really, really tough. That's just a couple of brands I've been looking at. A couple of brands I've been having my eyes on. Snatch a couple of pieces here and there because they all sound some smooth fly for real. Not really messing with that. So that's just a couple of brands. Like I said, man, if you got more brands for me, let them know. I love finding out new brands. I know you guys love the same because that's why I've been getting so many requests to do this video. So I know you guys love, I love learning new brands. So if you got a new brand, drop it down in the comments below. Uh, I'll check them out for real. I'll give you the credit, of course. Um, but yeah, tap in, drop a comment down below if you like this video, if this video helped at all. I'm just trying to help even one of y'all. I'm just trying to help um, like, comment, subscribe, new videos on the way. Um, I love y'all, man. Stay tuned, cause I'll be back very soon, man.